This episode of Mob Psycho definitely gets into the mind of Mob's brother very well, I found, and sets it up for him, in my opinion, still to be some sort of villain down the line. So we get the little more, you know, progression of what happened last week. It does turn out that he is just jealous of Mob. Despite Mob and his family always praising him, he actually wants what Mob has. He doesn't have these special powers. He actually thinks he is less than Mob. Though Mob is scared of his powers, you know, he actually wants to be like Mob, which was interesting. I guess I should have seen that coming, but to me, it looked like he was frightened of Mob last week. But the interesting thing is, despite him not appearing to have powers, at the end we can see he destroyed that spoon, so possibly he has some insane powers that might even be able to rival Mob in some way, only time will tell, but it's interesting because he definitely becomes a corrupt bastard in this week's episode. The president of the school actually gets him to blame Tenga for stealing the girl's flutes, so everyone thinks he's a pervert, and his life is just ruined after all of his hard work, and I mean, I can understand, you know, him being jealous of Mob and kind of going down a darker path, but you don't need to be that big of a dick to Tenga, I mean, despite even if you hate the guy like fuck like th this guy literally just got his high school life ruined because of these two sick bastards i mean the president himself was like laying in trash in his room so i mean i can understand him with his whole life of being corrupt but he didn't need to bring down mob's brother i forget his name but you know he's mob's brother at the end of the day but this episode was really good there's not a whole lot to discuss with the episode it's more or less setting up the possibility because dimple does reappear after you know Mob's brother does well like well once the viewer learns that he does have powers he still thinks he's powerless so i'm wondering will dimple manipulate him into being evil because now that he has this corruption in his heart now that he does have some sort of powers being awakened even if he doesn't realize it i mean dimple could see that he has magic presence or psychic presence that is so he might manipulate him into bringing down Mob in some way, because there is this jealousy, and jealousy can lead to evil. So, will Dimple and him, you know, team up, take down Mob, or try to? I think it's a possibility, but it's going to be very interesting, especially to see what his powers truly are, what he can truly do, because is gonna be good but i really liked once again how much detail they put into all the individual facial expressions things like that they shift the tone so much so it always leaves you wanting more but at the beginning of the episode we see reagan talking well impersonating a guy's dead father and the whole interactions between the two was so funny especially when the guy just wanted the safe password so he could be rich and he just knocks the guy out with one of his superhero moves like that's great i mean reagan we don't see him a lot on screen but when we see him it's always comedy gold and i like him so much for that but yeah i mean this episode setting up the possibility of mob's brother being evil being corrupt like he's going down a dark path and now that he has dimple or at least no now that he's met dimple i think we're gonna get some interesting content for the next few episodes especially with him discovering his powers I mean, he, I don't think he's going to try to hurt Mob purposely, but he's definitely going to be an antagonist in some way for Mob. That's where I see it going. I don't see any other way around it. Please, no spoilers for people who read the manga. This is just me theorizing myself as an anime only, but it's going to be damn interesting to say the least. Like I said, there's not a whole lot to discuss. It was a fantastic episode. It's really setting where this season's going to be going. Now that we know that, you know, he does have powers, he has met Dimple, there are so many ways it could go but i'm interested to hear what do you guys think do you think his jealousy is going to lead him down an even darker path now that he is dimple do you think they're going to team up and dimple's going to manipulate the hell out of this guy because this guy's evil you know dimple is a cute little bastard but he is evil and he could easily manipulate him especially because he'll be able to see that he does have power so you think you know they're going to be teaming up against mob i think that's where it's going but i'm interested to hear what everyone thinks but overall really i don't really have a you know, kind of a con to the episode really i kind of wish that reagan scene was a bit longer we got a bit more reagan but he served his purpose you know we got the comedy and and, it, and you know reagan even tells him like oh your mom's brother and you don't have psychic powers like that's a stab in the back right there and that's gonna kind of push him over the edge i think but let me know your thoughts in the comments below did you love it did you hate it what do you think or where do you see the series going be sure to hit that like button to share your support and also subscribe if you're new to my channel so until next time everyone please take care and have a good one